This is a KGUN 9 on your side news update. Thanks for tuning in. I'm Stella Inger. A standoff situation on the northwest side tonight. Officials say they were looking at a home where Jason Patty was inside. Patty was wanted after a hit and run last month. He and a female companion were on a motorcycle when a car stopped in front of them and they crashed into the back of the car. The woman died after that crash. Patty ran away. Today, the U.S. Marshals, Pima County Sheriff's Department and Tucson Police were all on scene looking for Patty. And one person is in the hospital after a rollover in Marana. This was a scene on I-10 near Tangerine. A uh, Northwest Fire officials say traffic on I-10 was not affected, but there could be some restrictions on the frontage road. No word on the condition of the person in the car. And take a look at this palm tree. The fire is out now after burning near a house on McGee. Golder Ranch Fire Department tweeted this video. They say the fire was put out without any problems. No word if intense weather in that area caused the fire. And Kyler Diggs joins us now with a look at our weather. Boy, it's been a busy day for you. Oh, man, has it ever, Stella. And uh, you know what? We've got more rain on the way. We still have some flood advisories in effect for southeastern Arizona. But uh, we could see some more rain rolling in here overnight tonight and even into early tomorrow and then another round of showers and thunderstorms back in the forecast for uh, Thursday and a few more on Friday. But I think we're going to start to dry it out as we head on into the weekend. So I think we've got one more fairly active day on Thursday and then we do dry it out as we go into the weekend and by the middle of next week. Notice that we are back up to 100 degrees. Kyler, thank you and thank you for tuning in. I'm Stella Inger for Kega 9 on your side.